in knitting there are three stitches a knit stitch a tuck stitch and a miss stitch a knit stitch is where a complete loop is formed a tuck stitch is where you have a half stitch so let's see in this you have a knit stitch which is a complete loop and you have a tuck stitch which is a half loop and then you have a knit stitch so tuck stitches basically will increase the width of the fabric or maybe it creates bulk in the width of the fabric so there are structures like you have a cardigan structure which is made up of tuck stitches so you can have a closer look at this that's a tuck stitch it, it just goes like a wave so this fabric has a lot of bulk this is a full cardigan fabric you have arms this is a one by one cardigan the face and the back is exactly the same so you see arms arms but this fabric has a lot of stretch in the widthwise direction so the length of the fabric basically reduces and the width of the fabric increases so let's see how do you represent a tuck stitch so this is a complete loop this is a elongated loop but this is also a complete loop this is a complete loop so this is complete loop complete loop complete loop this is the arm so therefore the stitch notations are in the downward direction if you look at the next course you have a complete loop a half stitch and you have a complete loop complete loop so half stitch is like this it's like a wave knit stitch and the last course is all complete loop so you have all complete loops a tuck stitch is generally represented by a dot so you can have a graphical rep representation also so this is called a held loop because it is not knitting for some time so this is the technical face let's see how is a tuck stitch so when when you have a tuck stitch what happens is the needle actually goes halfway up and it just receives a new yarn so it forms like floats like this let's see how do you draw a tuck stitch so I'm drawing the technical back draw the heads you can draw a technical face also technical face you can experiment yourself so miss one so I have missed here one loop you can miss at any place and you can do the designs okay draw the feet so when you draw a tuck stitch it just needs to go above like this and it will come here so I missed one loop here so this forms a long so this is the held loop. This is the held loop. So draw the arms. Complete the course on top okay so there are four wheels one two three and four so that's the held loop here and that's the half stitch so that's the tuck stitch this is the so tuck stitches are used for making pk structures and cardigan and there are some more designs thank you